Hi, my name is Kyle Courtney. I'm Copyright Advisor and Program Manager for the Office for Scholarly Communication here at Harvard University Library. I'm happy and delighted to welcome everyone to the celebration of the second annual Fair Use Week. Fair Use Week is based on an idea from ARL's Best Practices for Libraries and Fair Use that was developed in 2013. In 2014, I picked up that idea and ran with it and launched our own Beta Fair Use Week here at Harvard Library, and I'm happy to say it was a great success. I'm even happier to say that we have worldwide partnerships, and many thanks to ARL for hosting this year's Fair Use Week. Last year when I launched the Beta Fair Use Week here at Harvard, uh, we have discovered a real thirst for the knowledge and understanding of fair use amongst all our communities, regardless of whether you were in the arts, the sciences, uh, big data, computer science, the need for an understanding of fair use was critical to everyone's work. We invited panelists and experts on fair use to join us here at Harvard, and we had posts from scholarly experts from around the world. I'm happy to say that we have taken this conversation into the next year in our celebration of the second annual Fair Use Week. This year, my emphasis in Fair Use Week is on copyright in libraries. Copyright law affects a librarian's work every day. In fact, I like to say every day is a fair use day in a modern 21st century library. Here at Harvard, we've taken the step to make copyright law an important and critical part of a librarian's day. Here at Harvard, we've established a Copyright First Responders Network, which trained librarians on the nuances of copyright law, and especially fair use, to serve their communities. Massachusetts was the venue, and Harvard librarians and historians were the parties to the first fair use case heard here in the United States in 1841. The case, heard by Justice Joseph Story, was titled Folsom v. Marsh and established what is the modern equivalent of the four-factor test for fair use that we use in courts today. In keeping with that historical narrative, Harvard Library has deemed fair use an important and critical component of every librarian's work. With the Copyright First Responders Program, we've realized that the thirst for knowledge amongst our own community is as important as it is nationwide. Librarians deal with fair use every single day, and we want to make sure that they're in the best position possible to give the information to the patrons, scholars, visiting researchers, and students so that they can make their own decisions about their own research and their own scholarship. This year, with help from our partners worldwide and ARL, we're hoping to pick up on the conversation that we had last year and talk about the emphasis of the importance of fair use both to our users, researchers, students, faculty, and staff. I encourage you to follow our activities online on our Twitter handle, at Fair Use Week, or you can visit the website, fairuseweek.org, which is run by ARL, which has a calendar of events in which all libraries, universities, and institutions will be celebrating Fair Use Week. Thank you, and have a happy Fair Use Week.